these birds decoy like nothing else. I'm Claudio Angaro, and I'm going to tell you why snow goose hunting is so fantastic. In the past, snow geese had a bad rap. Couple reasons. There weren't as many around, they were smart, and we didn't have the technology to shoot them. I've gone through so many phases as a bird hunter. When I first started in 1994, I just couldn't get enough of decoy in those big Canada's. Fast forward a few years after that, it was the mallard thing. I just love watching those mallard drakes bow up late in the fall. Couldn't get enough of that. Then the speckle bellies rolled onto our scene. And of course they became a challenge and we just loved smashing those. And it was a challenge to figure it out. We got those dialed in and I love hunting them. But nothing does it like snow geese. Now it's a lot different when you do it right. When you don't do it right, you're gonna have a tough day out there. But when you do it right, Nothing go, does guys, it better. Go, go, go. Oh. <laughs> I got it. And it's all foreplay when it comes to these things. They'll hang up and they'll watch and they'll be 300 yards out, 200 yards out, 100, and you can see them. Their necks are craned, they're looking down, they're hanging up in the wind, and you think, oh man, are these things going to come down enough for us to shoot? Well, sure enough, if you're patient, you have a good hide. Lots of decoys, you played the wind right, you got your e-collar system set and some motion decoys out there, you're going to get them. The beauty about hunting them north of the 49th parallel, you're getting smaller flights of birds. 10, 12, go, 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 go. 50s. Sometimes you get them all. You might get 25 or 30,000 coming at once. We don't like that. It happens. Why else do they get a bad rap? Everyone says snow geese are bad eating. I tend to disagree. The average snow goose is about nine years old. You wouldn't eat a nine-year-old chicken either. Usually, you're shooting these juvies. We carve them up, we'll fast fry them or put them on the smoker after they've gone through the tenderizer. We jerky slice them and make some of the best jerky around. We hand it out to friends, relatives, landowners, you name it, and they love it. I hope you'll take the time to join us and come experience some of the absolute best snow goose hunting in the world. Try to do it again tomorrow? If we do it tomorrow, I'll give you a hundred bucks. Hey, all right, all right, all right. That worked out quite well. I mean, we had a lot of geese coming in here and 90, that's a good one. <laughs>